Kimari Childress, age 17, gunned down February 27, 2024, in Cape Girardo, Missouri. God bless the family and friends. Damn. year old teenager. Three people have been arrested, including one person who is facing murder charges tonight. Let's go live to Sabrina Winters, who talked to close family friends of the victim. Yes, Rod. Emotions are still running high. After the shooting in front of CVS, close family friends of Kimari Childress say the family is distraught and they want to know why. It's, it's tough, uh, for real. When it hits home like this and it hits close like this, yeah. uh, it's not easy because you see one of your um, people hurt, fellow, man. you know, family members hurt. Kwaku Arkaful is co-owner of Be Chosen Academy, and he tells me hearing the news about 17-year-old Kamari Childress is devastating. It hits home for him because he is a close friend of her parents. But no parent should be burying their child, you know. Um, that's probably one of the toughest things to do as a parent. The heartbreaking news comes after Kamari was shot and killed in front of CVS. One other person was also injured by a bullet. According to the Cape Girardeau Police, these are the three people arrested and charged. Trey Marion Jones with Class A felony murder in the first degree and other charges, Zamiah Smith with hindering prosecution, and Yannick Kane with tampering with physical evidence. He says Kamari's parents are close friends, often coming to his gym. He says Kamari was a girl who was full of life. Very polite and very nice to us and kind to us. As the incident is still fresh, he says the feeling a mother must have from losing her daughter is unimaginable. You know, she's struggling right now, so um, for everybody that's out there that knows her, and you don't know her, um, definitely be praying for her and her family, Jessica and Daryl. Future Krigler is fitness trainer at Be Chosen Academy, and he tells me the youth in the community need more guidance in activities to keep them level-headed and out of detrimental activities, and he leaves this message. I encourage you to bring them to be chosen and be a part of the animal, be chosen animal program. He says our youth need more mentors to stay active and on track. And we make them great. So give it a try. We have what you need here at Be Chosen. Police still haven't released a motive for the shooting but a link to Kamari's GoFundMe can be found on our website at kbsi23.com. Live in the studio, Sabrina Winters, Fox 23 News. Such a sad story, a young lady with uh, her whole life ahead of her. Sabrina, thank you for the uh, latest. 17-year-old girl and injured a man appear in Cape Girardeau court this or appear in court this morning. Uh, in Cape Girardeau County, Trey Marion Jones has been charged with first degree murder, among other charges. Yannick Kane was charged with tampering with physical evidence. Jameis Smith was charged with hindering prosecution and resisting a lawful stop. All three being held without bond. Now they appeared in court at 1030 this morning for their arraignments. We do have a crew in the courtroom, so look for more about what happened in the proceeding later on Heartland News. But that shooting took the life of this woman, 17 year old. Kimari Childress, who was working as a pharmacy tech at CVS when the shooting happened. The CVS in Cape released this statement saying that they are devastated to learn of Childress's death. CVS says that Childress was a bright young woman who cared for her patients. The company says that uh, they have been in touch with the family and their thoughts and prayers are with them at this time. Gun violence is always wrong and it's never right. This innocent woman killed. God bless the family again. Damn. A crucial reminder here. Help is available. If you or anyone you know is a victim of domestic violence, you can call the phone number there on your screen or simply text the word START to 88788. Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.